Okay, so I am going to make a really quick video showing you um, how hot this niche is. Uh, when I say a hot niche, one, Maureen says on her page right here uh, that she posted the book up and she had already made a sale. Uh, New Age stuff, tarot journals, astrology are all really great niches and underserved. Now what does underserved mean? Underserved means when you type in tarot journal and I'm using that um, cool new uh, Amazon uh, suggest expander that I talked about and it gives me these terms so I also have my keywords everywhere or anywhere everywhere and it also shows me what the Google search is uh, on Amazon so that helps a lot as well so combining these two things together I type it in I see it gets 880 searches a month when I go and take a look at that I'm I see that there's only 230 results so that's really cool. That means that there are not many people competing in this particular niche. But hold on. One of the important things to realize is that this says all departments, right? We want to go down to books and then we want to go and click on Prime. So I'm only looking at the people that are in my um, category and then I'm going to go down to paperbacks because I really do want to see what my competition is with other create space authors now there's 440 results but that's still half of what the monthly searches are so that's really pretty good um, looking at these numbers let's go back and see if I can go back to that original search we want to look at the ranks. Now I have also a tool called uh, DS Amazon Viewer, I think is what it's called. Uh, DS Amazon Quick View. And so with the video making, sometimes it's slow to pull up these ranks. But what I want to look at is the ranks that are showing for the books that are on this page. It doesn't look like it's going to cooperate here for me right at this moment, but that is something that I would look at. It was showing me the ranks that were on the other pages, so let's just dig back down here and see if we can get those to show up. Anyway, um, I do want to look and see if the ranks are fairly low somewhere you know around a hundred thousand that's really pretty good they're not coming up for whatever reason right now um, this one is this is fifty seven thousand that's a tarot journal so that's a good one this is eleven thousand that's positive energy um, that's a gratitude journal this is a tarot journal that's kinda high this is a tarot notebook not a journal uh, this one's pretty low. This is a card meanings workbook. Uh, this is a create space person. A lot of reviews. They put it up last year. Um, this is their own publisher. Put up actually this year. Um, this one is using the Rider Weight deck. I'm surprised that they're actually able to have their covers there. These books are not, these cards are not in the public domain right now. So this person could actually get in trouble using this deck. Uh, so it's been there for a year, so maybe they're not going after people anymore that have those. So it looks like the numbers aren't too bad to show that I might be able to actually get some decent sales. So I'm going to go ahead, uh, I purchased it already, and I'm going to go ahead and make a couple of books. I'm not just going to title it Tarot Journal, so let's look at some other terms that I can have. This is that other tool I talked about called Suvli, and uh, let's see, this actually looks at the Amazon search, so journal, journaling, journal book, uh, journal blank, you don't want Kindle. This is on Bing, journaling, 
um, tips, ideas, uh, prompts. So a journal prompt would be a cool one. Um, journaling prompts would be a cool one. Um, here's another one, uh, exercises. So journaling exercises would be a good one. So these are some really good ideas uh, for you to take to heart to use for your keywords. In Merchant Words, which I'll download the CSV file for you, uh, you can take a look at these. Now these numbers, as I've pointed out before, are higher than they really show. These are not really true estimated monthly. I really don't know where they get these numbers because um, Amazon really doesn't share them. They do say that they have access to Amazon's API, so I kind of have to trust what they're saying. Um, but Tarot Journal, um, putting it backwards really doesn't help. Tarot Journaling, Tarot Journal Book, Tarot Notebook Journal, Tarot Reading Journal, Cards Journal, Journal for Tarot. So these are all titles that you can use um, and also put in your descriptions as well as in your subtitles. So I'll download this one and let you guys know about it and post that in the group. Hopefully that helps.